Oh, welcome back to the funny card game. I'm gonna play some more. I should play some Everhood, but I'm playing more Inscription. Because right now I'm enjoying that a lot more. <clears throat> I don't like suffering. We got a new starter deck, so we're gonna be get to try that out. Um, we have to get one win with every starter deck for an achievement. So we're gonna start with this guy. So yeah, I it, this actually might screw me because I do tend to like drop down, but it's okay. We will try and just pull teeth a bunch. We'll pull, we'll, we'll, we'll try and just like this is another achievement for pulling 32 teeth in a run. So if we can find some way to get more teeth pulling. Oh shit. Cat is really good. ringworm this early, you know? Because, like, if we... That's what we can do, right? So we can analyze, we can think a bit. I don't want to do the totem fight, so we go over here, and then we branch across to get the our starting... St to, uh, to start our totem. Because if we go to the fire and we sacrifice ringworm, we can just max out at every fire. God damn it, every time. <laughs> every time I do it to Ringworm, he just becomes strong. Which I'm fine with, but it just ma it's annoying. It's a bad idea. Oh. That's not very sweet and cool. Damn, man can't keep, he cannot catch a break. Okay, I'm realizing a problem. And that's that we only have a moose and a mantis that can do damage. So we need to solve that dilemma as soon as possible. Preferably by feeding a worm to a fire. I don't have any money, dude. I should have read the line. I'm sorry. My mind falters. 
Bifurcated! <laughs> oh, baby. Bifurcated as a totem? Ooh, we gotta get the moose head. <laughs> let's, let's immediately go silly mode. Kind of tempted to just throw the mantis down there, you know? Also, I now understand why we are given the black goat at the beginning. It's because it can insta the moose, right? It's just like summon greater moose. Fuck. Uh-oh. Uh. Uh, 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 uh. This is okay. We're gonna take a damage, but we'll get to summon our moose. That's not a moose! You make him my life a so hard! And this guy's gonna kill him instantly if I summon mole. Can I take three damage? No, I can't. I can technically, but the following turn I wouldn't be able to save myself, so I need to do something. Teeth. If I do that, next turn, I summon Moose, kill Adder, moves over here, Bullfrog hits it. I take one more damage the following turn. I believe I'm correct. I believe I'm correct, and that is what matters. Oh, thank you. Now, if I were to start doing damage, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, so I would just end up flat. I won't, I wouldn't be able to gain money, so I'm not gonna try. We do kind of need items this time, though. What? It's an ant queen, you know? It's an ant queen. Okay, you know? It's an ant queen. We need a kingfisher and a beehive. Or a beehive and a kingfisher. I didn't even, like, get to look. Fuck. I need to pull out so many teeth. Thanks, God. Shout out my guy, God. It's pretty cool. I believe in this. Because Kingfisher is just gonna fly over anyway, so my mantis is safe. And then that's gonna, I think, evolve, which sucks. But nothing can be done, so nothing shall be done. If I leave it, will I be screwed? Maybe. Let's pull a tooth. <laughs> Let's pull some more teeth. God, I love pulling teeth. Uh, would it be worth it? No. What do I want 
want to bifurcate. on this next turn. So, we're gonna hope for Black Goat. Let's go! I'm gonna make three bucks. Not like we're gonna be buying anything, but just novelty. <sighs> Hate to do bugs again. But bugs, you know. Bifurcated do I want bifurcated bugs? Or bifurcated moose? I think bifurcated bugs because I'm I can run ants. Yeah, ant another ant queen? Bro. I'm fucking set. We're gonna get some more items and then grab a hopefully a bug head. Teeth, please. I want the ability to pull out my teeth, please. Please let me pull out my teeth. We're gonna pull out so many teeth. Please. Ah, uh, poo. Well, I guess we'll take... What's our deck? It is moose, moose, bug, bug, bug. So none of neither of these actually affect me, but we'll grab this because I don't like the birds. Is beehive kingfisher. Oh, that's like one of the little, like, um, that's what's his name's actual paintbrush, isn't it? I can't really see it, but it kind of looks like it's got, like, the green, I forget what they call them in this game. Yeah, no, that's a circle, and that's the reflection, because then there's the red one, and there's the green one. And that's, like, the blue, like, tealish circle. Is there a way to open this in Casey's mod? Also, let's... Swap the soundtrack every, every run. Metal bucket. He's the Angler. Quick, everyone, freak the fuck out. Do I want to start off with ants? No. Let's start with Black Goat. Moose. Oh, I could have pulled a couple... Actually, I could have pulled all the teeth and been fine.
Now I believe he won't fish me, because I'll kill him. Yeah, second phase. So now he's gonna put a bucket down in front of it. Which could become a problem. So, just to make sure it's absolutely not, uh, we're gonna use the smoke and the squirrel. As we all know, the angler notoriously does not want the smoke. Now, I know that would insta technically instant win, but we're just gonna get a new inventory, so let's clear it out, you know? Go fish. Don't need to, buddy. You better hit the docks. Start fishing yourself. Well, chat 13's a weird one, because it tends to end up screwing me over. Strange larva is a bug. And it is a bug I like. I'm gonna take strange larva. So we can get bifurcated bugs, and then I can have, like, dual Mothman if I can set it up. Uh. Uh, battered your body as you fight your way up to a vantage point. Snow-covered trees jutted from the landscape like prickly misplaced teeth. You continued on through the snow line. Very cool. Um... I think we're gonna take the right path, get three more teeth, rip three more teeth, and then take three more teeth. I, I forget if I've already given to context, there's an achievement for pulling like 32 teeth in a run. So that's what I'm trying to do. We don't have anything that does bones, and it's a bug! Teeth? Ah. Oh. Teeth! Would be nice to get a pack rat, but at the same time, I'm doing fine. Is there nothing I can do? You can summon a ringworm. Could do that. But what does that do for me aside from block a damage? I mean, I guess it's, it does just that blocks a damage. Forgot to pull my teeth. That should have been step one. back where we started. I am going to pass the turn again. Uh-oh! I forgot that they do that. Okay. We're gonna have to pull something. The only thing I think that I can reliably do might be able to get rid of the porcupine. And then, uh, I could tank the hit. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Okay. Uh, we, what we do is we, oh, fuck. There is a downside to this plan that I've realized. <laughs> and that's that in order for it to work, oh, no, that's right. Right, 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 right. We kill the thing. Uh, we just have to make sure we get everything in the right place. Because if... Oh, we're kind of fucked. <laughs> oh, shit. 
Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It does a total of ant damage. Do I have the bones? Can't I please just have the bone? Wait! It doesn't matter. Everything's okay. Everything's okay. I have the bones. Oh, fuck. Okay. Uh, uh. We're gonna take these scissors and snip you. Unfortunately, our other ant is going to die. <coughs> but I think they're running out of cards, so it should be okay. That's not awesome, man. That is not rated A for awesome. And I'll, oh, fuck, this guy's gonna evolve. And fucking screw me over. But if I just draw squirrels, if I can draw enough squirrels, I have a weird plan in my head that involves drawing as many squirrels as I can. Because if I can simply draw, right here, check this out. We got four coins. A squirrel. And a cockroach. <laughs> No! Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. I was so worried for a second, like, oh, fuck. Do I stand to gain anything? Uh, one, two, three, one, two, three, one. As of right now, yes. Yes, I do. I stand to gain so very much. I don't remember what it has, so I want to find out. Seven. Bifurcated would be so fucking good. Holy shit. Holy shit. Uh. And we. Cockroach we can throw in at the end. No, but we shouldn't, so let's not. Uh, and then we can use this. To. Ant Queen. We can squirrel the worker ant in. And I did not think about the mantis part. I wanted to get a mantis in there at the end as well. But I forgot to use the black goat to summon the ant queen so that we'd have the cockroach to summon the mantis. Well, it's still a lot. We're making money, even though we probably shouldn't care about making money. <sighs> Fucking... Ah! I don't want any of these. I don't want any of these. Take the bear, I guess. 
Thanks. Give me more teeth to pull, please. Thank you. Oh, I thank you. Oh. <laughs> we'll need this probably, because now we have a bear. So now it's just gonna be like, bear and moose, ha <laughs> ha. I'm like, fuck. Fuck. I'm already fucked. I can't, I'm, there's no reason to summon anything right now, so I'm just gonna pull my teeth. And start drawing from the deck. And hoping that it doesn't summon, like, anything of note, you know? Ant Queen. Can't really do anything right now. Um... But yes, you can. Cause if I do, yeah, okay. So we go like this. We black goat, so that we can summon Ant Queen, which will do one damage then, and then next turn it'll do two. Cause I'll draw a squirrel. And we work her ant. dub. Is it not beautiful? Do we have any dupe cards? We do. We have two ant queens, but it's better to keep them separated. So I don't want to go to the mycologists right now. amazing but it's something right it, it's or reborn strange larva let's go with ant queen because it can ultimately get us more ants Oh man, it's gonna screw me over if I sacrifice my black goat, but I, sh I probably should. Oh, I'm so screwed. I don't even have teeth to pull. How am I meant to succeed without being able to pull any teeth? We can mole for the first turn. Then we have to squirrel. And that starts the problem of, like, that's not enough. So, what, we draw a squirrel to summon an ant queen? I guess, because then we can squirrel to summon ant. But he'll just kill ant. We have a rabbit pelt we could block with for an extra turn. That might be worth something. Yeah. Okay. So now we draw a squirrel. We block with rabbit pelt. And we draw one more squirrel.
Now since... I guess it doesn't matter. No, it does, it does, it does matter. If we do this, it'll kill the queen. And then... This is like so awful. We can't do, we can't make any real ground. Technically, we're like technically making like slight ground, but it's not enough. And we're now in the same situation I was in before where it's like, what do I even do? Do I just draw more squirrels? I think we have to try and draw from deck. We're screwed if we don't. Yeah, we... Oh, well... At least we won't take the full force. Never mind. <laughs> I forgot that they transform. Mm. Yeah. Anything that introduces a moose to combat? Not fun. I would like... I should probably get another black goat. And the only reason I should get another black goat is because I'm about to sacrifice a black goat. Get some ringworm, please. Why do you let him survive? Why? <laughs> Why won't you just eat the ringworm and be poisoned? Have a black goat. I got it just for you. Me and all my bone cards are really gonna benefit. I mean, it's, I, I can summon Cockroach off first turn now, so yes, I actually do. Shouldn't have done that either. <gasps> it doesn't kill. Holy shit. That's amazing. Fuck. I lose now. I just lose outright. Yep. Ow. You're bad at video games. I know. I couldn't get a totem head at all. Like there was like there were opportunities, but I just wasn't able to take them because I'm trying to pull all my teeth out. And then I stopped trying to pull my teeth out to try and survive. I really should just wait till I get like the ant deck. worry about buying pelts or getting shit just focus on surviving go ahead offer me ringworm fuck you does corpse maggots do it i think corpse maggots also has that effect um
Well, frankly, I'm going to take corpse maggots. I'm going to take the cat. I'm going to try and feed corpse maggots to this fire. Eat up, boys. You guys suck. <laughs> Do I dare? do I want to? I do like having agency in what I get, but at the same time, I need a totem. I'm gonna take the agency and then try and burn those corpse maggots some more. If I can get a worker ant and put the ant queen thing on the worker ant, I might just do that. Uh, here, have the corpse maggots. Eat it up, eat up, eat up. Yes! Okay, that should make it so that at fires we can now just go crazy. feel like might be a little excessive but at the same time I didn't need to grab that squirrel but figure you know empty the backpack so that when we get to one we can benefit from it um, yeah a little squirrel a little cat a little worker ant Decided to grab a squirrel. I forgot we had cat from the hit show, Salmon Cat. Um, now that wouldn't do more. Um, dang. Okay. I don't care. I just want to get more items in my belly, but not going that way. That way seems stinky. You, I could tell that it was the old data before I flipped it, but I'm gonna take it because nothing, uh, no, nothing better than. Uh, oh gosh, a bug. Okay, we have bug head, so no matter what, we're good now. Ringworm.
Okay. That doesn't help me. Uh, can we survive all the damage? One, uh, two, three, four. No! We have to you do something. Great. Nothing better than having to do something and having nothing to actually really do. I guess I'll summon Ringworm and hope that it poisons the coyote when it kills it. It won't, but I'm gonna hope. Cool. Well, now I can't do anything again. Both because uh, all my cards are summon helping cards and I don't have any notable summons. Hey, a quick question about this starter deck. Uh, are you supposed to be able to win with it? <laughs> you know, like the, it seems like the starting area is just the hardest fucking time. With this fucking moose thing. Like, I get the premise. You could just insta summon moose if you have a thing, but you only have one. You know? And we're taking the mantis, because it's a one cost damaging card, and we don't have any of those, apparently. And you know what? And you know what? Infinite summoning off of an ant queen? Maybe. Infinite summoning off of a mantis. So that can hide behind a tree and still attack, you know? Get some items. I'd like to pull out my teeth, please. Please let me pull out my teeth, please. I would like to pull out my teeth. It's the prospector. The perspicky. Where's that hound of mine? I don't know, bro. Oh, don't yell at me. Oh, well, this is a fucking rousing round. Maybe I'll pull my teeth right now. Just get ahead of the curve, you know? Fuck. 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 Thank you. Thank you, Lord. I just realized the mistake in my actions. Magnabbit! I've used my ultimately what is effectively my strongest combo at the beginning. However, it has given me enough time to I think have both the moose and, uh, yeah, we can just insta moose. And we have a wild bull, so that's pretty cool. Oh, I forgot to pull out my teeth. Extra red. for relighting my candles. <sighs> Fuck. Give me something, man. Gek. Hand over the Gek. 
Don't do the snow line. Don't! I just said. The beauty of the falling snow could not distract you from the chill in your bones. Your body quaked in a futile attempt to maintain warmth. You had finally reached the snow line. Fork. I forgot to check what the painting is. Field mice and bat. He gave them to me. They're on opposite ends. Field mice left, bat far right. Going this way. Bugs. Totem, please. Cool bugs, please. Cool bugs. Extra cool bugs, please. Well, I mean, it's something. Spike bugs, it's something. You know, spikes on the bugs. And the ants are bugs, and, and that might be good. <laughs> I'm sorry. All those words didn't make sense. Oh! Sorry, that was my stretching noise. <laughs> Okay. I don't know what I did there. That's how it's done, baby. Challenge. <laughs> really valuable bugs. Pushy bugs. Big blood. Like, blood bug could be. Ac actually, blood bug, like mosquito. I'm just gonna call it mosquito build because they're blood suckers. Uh. Full mosquito bugs could be cool, because then it's like... I can summon my best off of just the... the well... Uh, let's... Gek. Save me. Uh oh. If I do one damage, it'll be fine. I'm led to believe this will work. Also, I just realized infinite big blood mantis. That's what that thing. Um, and now I think we're fine. Everything is okay.
thanks. Alright. What do you have to say, guy? What, what's your offering? What's your meager offering to this deity? Trial of health. I do have a lot of health. Uh, the three carat, four blood cost. Uh, at least four power. Well, I think the health one would be best. Because I have some high health guys that can just insta win it. That's not awesome. One from the. One from the bat. <laughs> four from the mole. Success. Suckies! A possum. A submerged ant spawn possum. And then I could use that to summon the ant that it spawns. <laughs> Interesting. I'm kind of digging the big blood bugs, though. So we're just going to take this, and then we're going to go like so. Because strong. I like strong. I think we go upright to the fire. Interesting. I'm f I've been faced with a real conundrum, but it's an interesting conundrum in that it solves itself, it's just a little complex. Because ultimately, I can summon get an ant who I can then put down the moose. Now, we need something. Thank you, Mac. But not actually, fuck. Uh, what are we taking? Three, four, where are the scales at? Okay, so that puts us to there. Four. Yeah, okay. Um, and then... Okay, we're good. Now we're not. Now we're not. Nope, we're fine, we're fine. Actually, we're 100% we're fine. I was wrong, I forgot. They're silly. They're silly little guys. Sometimes they're just silly little guys. On on occasion, I've found that they tend to be silly little guys. Okay. Now we do some damage back. Forked. And then we uh, draw a card. We do it. Because it's a card and it's an option. We draw a card. It's a card. So that's pretty cool. Play it, I guess. You know? It's there. It's an option. So we should probably take it. Uh, and a mantis. That could be so like one extra point of damage. That could be pretty sound. That could a uh, hey, you know. <laughs> it was an extra point of damage. What can I tell you? We were heading up to the shop anyway. I think we'll just take his knife. Honestly, it's like I could buy. I could. 
technical. Why is it? No, it's not. I can't buy that. It's like, why is it? Like, cause see this tooth? See how it goes down? What's with that? Is it because it's on a card? Probably because it's on a card. <laughs> of course you have others. You have an entire stage of them. Um, I don't know what I'm going to sacrifice here. Put mole on moose, maybe. Um, could bifurcate moose. Bifurcated moose could be silly. was bifurcated. Oh, they're here. These fucking clowns are here. What do I do? Just once. No. Just the one time, thanks. I've... I've... I've I know better now. Bifurcated moose is silly because in two turns it hits the whole screen. Like the whole enemy field. Oh, well, thank God we got a mole, you know? I was worried. Stab one of those. Hey, robot. Oh, you're so fucking awesome. I just want to quickly. The creature opposing it perishes. side and we regain four so when we take four it doesn't matter um let me draw some things draw Eating a fucking apple. <laughs> you know what I mean? Also, we are gonna have to play a card here. We need to play, I think, a squirrel. So that he can't move further. Because we don't want him to move to the right. Because if he were to, then he wouldn't be able to do full damage. Oh, 
this, the rest will stay and fight for me. I'm gonna take uh, this and this, and I think I'll <laughs> I'll take this as well for no real reason. Just thought it'd be cool. Admittedly, <laughs> Shifu. Alright, so we take this silly little worker ant, right? And we go like that, and then we take our... <sighs> oh, jeez. Uh, we take our ant queen, right? And we go... And then we... Oh, right! They're not infinite. They're not infinite. Okay. Squirrel... Only this guy is infinite. Fun is infinite. Sega Enterprises. Uh, and then we... Work around. I don't know why I didn't consider bifurcating the moose sooner. <laughs> Amalgam? I'm interested by this question mark fellow. Because he was... Before, when we unlocked him, it said that he was Mole Man question mark. Maybe I unlocked Amalgam question mark and just didn't notice. But... I'm interested. I probably shouldn't have taken that. Uh, cut back to this clip later when I uh, inevitably fail. Oh, I'm in the wetlands. Um, I'm pretty satisfied with what I have right now. Depending on if we get... Bifurcation again. Trust me, I did want it. I really did want it. And I still want it. God, I wish I could go back. God, I wish I could go back. <laughs> it's... Why'd I do that? My brain was like, I just don't want this adder. Let's see if we can feed it. Go ahead, folks. Eat up. Manja, manja. just need to get the moose out. If we can do that, we're fine. So let's just... Ding! Oh, that kills us, though. I'm silly! I forgot! I forgot that we have one less. So I was like, oh, we'll be at one, and then we can just move on. Not so. Um... Let's go over here. Bugs. Ant. Alright, uh, let's... Since we have this goofy totem thing going on... Uh, where's our other... Our initial black goat? Keep offering him goats. If I have two of them, does it stack? If I have two, do it stack? Taking the easy fight. I think it... I don't... Yeah, it doesn't. It doesn't stack. Unless maybe I'm 
making a mistake and thinking of something else. It's possible. Well, this isn't particularly awesome. Uh... Don't get me wrong, it's a good hand. Um, it's just trying to keep my, my fucking guy alive. It's like logically what I should do, and even though I don't like it being there, is I should put like this down here. And then just like throw down Kingfisher over here. Thank you, Lord. It's Ejerok! That's what it does. Cool, so whatever... That's awesome. Oh, that's also awesome. <laughs> that's very funny and cool. Okay, we have an Ejerok. That's what it is. Oop. I keep forgetting what the other thing I need is. Rat King! We're saved. This is a one run. We have Rat King. Nothing bad happens. We've we haven't lost when we when we've appeased the Rat King. They're not victims. Oh, we can just take one? Guess I'll take another ant queen. Thanks. Ah, duplication. I could get another bifurcated moose, maybe. But I kind of want to go up to this fire and see if it, my plan worked. And get a couple bone cards, because now we have bones going. We got the bones flowing. Well, this is about to get just so silly immediately. They had an ant as well. So I'm going to reallocate my ants. Okay. I think we're fine. Pretty sure we're fine. Yeah, okay, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. I think we just insta win now. Six brings us to W. Yay! Give me bones. I want bones. Would like bones. Bones, bones, bones. Turkey vulture. Sure. We can insta summon off the bat. That'd be interesting. 
Fire. Did my adder plan work? It did! <laughs> okay, so if it as long as it's poison, it's fine. Uh what do I want to increase the like strength of? Do I want to just make like the most powerful rat king? Or just like a really strong mantis? Just make a really healthy mantis. Well, now I know. Feed the adder to the whatever. Can't kill the rat king. That would be cruel and unjust. Um, we could put ant queen on a normal ant. Make it cheaper. Now for the angler. Holy fuck. If I... No, okay, hold on, hold on. Oh, right. Okay, squirrel. Play the mantis. We play worker ant off of a mantis. We play another worker ant off of a mantis. And then we throw a bat down. And that should do five. But that, oh, it doesn't matter if we do five. Oh, it doesn't matter if they summon a shark. Get fucking nae on, dude. Oh, I'm gonna fucking beat you up. She's so getting beat up. Look at how beat up you're getting. Go ahead, summon him. What do I care? I do, I do care a lot, actually. <laughs> a lot to deal with. Um, well, that's at least a replacement for that ant that's about to get brutally mauled. A replace mm, ant. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> if we just went a little silly goofy. Ejerok! Sometimes Ejerok just shows up. I'm not perish quite yet. Perhaps another Ejerok would entice you. No, but I'll take the amalgam for its funny blood properties, I guess. Even though they don't benefit me. It's like, it's a bonus. Uh, let's get some items for the final fight, because I only have a, a bone pig. Fan can really save us, so can the scissors. I want to win. Let's win. We've made it to the end again. Let's fucking win.
out. you oh geck we need to find a way to save him trolls you again trolls you again dude holy shit I fucking got you, dude. I- you thought- you thought for a second, you were like, oh shit, what if he- what if he does something? And then I did. And what- and what- what were you to even do about it? What could you even do about it, you know? Like, what- what- what move did you even have? Did you have a plan? Was there a plan? Throw down an ant queen, throw down Gek, throw out a fucking worker ant. Oh please, yes, I'm really invested. I gotta I just oh you're so cool. Actually you are gonna fuck me up here. Yeah, that is a slight problem. Don't do it. Okay. What does a mole do? You know, what, what happens if I play a mole? Does it only get hit once or does it get hit four times? It only gets hit once! Okay, we have turns to draw. <laughs> oh! One of these is an Ejirok. Neither of- that's not a bad thing, mind you, it's just it's very shocking. Put down a rabbit pelt to block damage. And now... And we grab left, because good adventurers always go left and it's closest to the Rat King. Alright, I don't know if it can be... Card bearing the sigil pulls smaller creatures like squirrels into orbit. Uh, strike each opponent's area of the And then. Mighty Leap. Yeah. No kidding. So, can it even respond? It can't. It cannot. <laughs> cool. Oh my god! <laughs> You're gonna do that to me! You're gonna give me field mice right at the end? When I can't benefit because the bat's already dead? Oh. I've been playing this new inscription now for a few days. Working has been unproductive. I emailed, yeah, I emailed some of the other devs, kind of probing to see if they know anything about this without appearing crazy. No dice. Strange thing, the game is fun. 
It's an actually a good game. But Stranger's still leshy. He talks to the challenger almost as if he's talking to me. It's freaky, but not altogether unwelcome. I could use a friend. Damn. It's pretty epic. Flying ant! <laughs> the power of flying ant is equal to the number of ants the owner has on their side of the table. That's awesome. Ants! The ant deck. Holy shit, it's what I've always wanted. All regular battles are replaced with totem battles. Really? That's so stinky and mean, dude. What's the what's the qualifier? 40. I feel like it's better to just go like that, you know? I, I'm so loathing the day that it's like I have to do the every challenge at once thing. But anyway, that's all for now. Actually, I might just do that because I, I barely use the shops. I probably should use the shops, but I don't. Anyway, that's another success. Uh, I'm, uh, again, I'll probably be back later. Uh, Spider-Man 2 just came out on PS5, or like I think it comes out today on PS5 at some point, so my dear friend Landon uh, won't be hanging out as often because he's been super hyped for the game so i'm gonna be going live a lot more frequently throughout the day uh so if you see me go live two or three more times today that's why but until next time i've been creature you've been the lovely chat this has been inscription uh, casey's mod and it's been fun oh actually i don't think i actually did that right uh, I've been Creature, you've been a lovely chat and the beautiful viewer at home. This has been Casey's Mod, and it's been, Inscription Casey's Mod, and it's been fun. See ya. I'm gonna keep stumbling, uh, baby.